and turn our attention from the NFL game to the college game. UNLV is turning all sorts of heads this year. Well, nothing COVID related, but recruiting related. John Treach now joins us tonight as we talk about UNLV recruiting. And John, boy, the Rebels turning heads with some of these recruits they're getting. Yeah, Chris, you know, recruiting rankings can be ridiculous, but people look at them. UNLV is currently number one in the Mountain West, according to 24 7 Sports. In a time where you can't see players in person, this feels like a Zoom national title. <laughs> Barry Switzer, Oklahoma's great coach and legendary living room salesman, once said, It's not about the X's and O's, it's about the Jimmies and Joes. And for Marcus Arroyo, right now it's about the Aaron's, Anthony's, Nick's, and Jalen's. In the past seven days, UNLV has landed six commitments, the program's most prodigious recruiting weekend in history. The Rebels' rookie coach has connected and cultivated a brand, Rebel Vision 2021. Recruiting season is like a trailer, and this crop of prospects has brought out the Hollywood production. So with that being said, within the next three to four years, I'll be attending to the University of Las Vegas. Go Rebels, baby. But the name that may mean the most, Aaron Holloway from Legacy High School, the first Las Vegan to stay home. Everybody left. Everybody's going to other places like USC, Oregon, and places like that. And I feel like it'll be good for me to stay home and make some from where I came from. For a program not particularly proud of its past, the future is full of momentum. Interestingly enough, the postponement of the high school sports season has many prep stars committing early. UNLV is seizing the opportunities, Chris. Hey, John, let me ask you, uh, of course, UNLV getting lots of pats on the back right now for what they're doing outside the state. A lot of coaches, players, parents wondering what about these local recruits and how is UNLV, what they doing to keep the kids here in Vegas? Yeah, you're right, Chris. They are selling it well outside. They're doing really well in California, Southern California particularly, also in Texas. But the key is, I went back and looked, there are 13 kids who have committed from the following class from Las Vegas. Only one is staying home, but that one can be a domino. Uh, Aaron Holloway from Legacy, a great player, an excellent player who could contribute right away, but you look at uh, kids signing to Oregon, USC, you can't blame them, but I think UNLV needs to focus on the ones who are going to Fresno State. That's a peer, right? Colorado State, that's a peer. Two kids from the area are going to Colorado State, and uh, UNLV needs to focus on winning those kids over. All right, you got to get the best players in the Mountain West. Thank you very much, John. Appreciate that. Still ahead on.